all over the lander, the suits, the skin. Lunar dust is said to be like graphite, but more abrasive. It's horribly itchy and irritating to breathe. In fact, the duo would end up sleeping in their helmets and gloves at night. When they got back to Earth, that dust was everywhere too, even on their isolation garments as they got out of the ocean. Anyway, when they arrived in Houston, they were about to begin their three-week quarantine, a NASA photo technician called Terry Slezak picked up a film cassette retrieved from the moon and suddenly noticed that his hand was covered in moon dust. Slezak and five others joined the three astronauts in quarantine. Other breaches soon followed. On the 27th of July, a bag holding lunar samples sprung a leak. On the 28th, a biocabinet glove ripped open on a quail cage. On the 29th, gas was seen bubbling from bathroom fixtures in one of the labs. 